Hello everyone, um, my name's James Dundon, I'm from Modbury High School, um, I'm the science coordinator there and also I guess um, a bit of a flip learning cult leader I found myself being, I'm always like, hey, you, come over here, have you heard about flip learning or do you know you could do flip learning in English, PE? So I've sort of been, yeah, a bit of a, a, bit of a cult leader in, in my school about getting flip learning going. Um, basically because I just see how um, beneficial it is. Um, so basically what I thought is I'd introduce um, some of the ways to connect with me. Um, so you can connect with me on Twitter, uh, Google Plus, um, or look at my YouTube channel. Uh, I've also, uh, for the biology teachers out there, um, in conjunction with Jeremy LeCornu, we run uh, Anytime Education, which basically puts all of our videos together that hits our Year 12 biology topics and puts them all in a really easy um, place for students to find. And you can also uh, follow us on Facebook as well. So on the website, you know, part of the flip learning is creating the explicit teaching content, um, but YouTube doesn't do the best job at, um, I guess, organizing it. So we've made this website to basically easily organize uh, the content. So you can find anything on nucleic acids or enzymes, click in that and there's a video there. Um, so basically my role in this PD session is basically to walk you through um, my experiences of developing videos, um, which is the second um, important part of flip learning, or maybe even the least important part. Um, so share my experiences with making videos um, and how that's developed over time. And then I'll be basically in the studio at Brighton High School, which is very similar to my own, um, showing you the ropes there, and also um, giving you sort of helpful hints and tips from what I've learned. So basically I started out um, just wanting to record my content for students that miss lessons. So if they weren't there, they missed my explicit teaching, and then I was like, well, do I have to do that all again? So I started recording actually my live lessons. So this is it here. Oh, if I go back. So this is uh, using a GoPro, um, recording one of my live lessons. Um, obviously not ideal for flip learning because what we've found is you can basically do a whole 45 minutes lesson in about six minutes. And that's much more engaging for students. So this was just how I started, recorded my lessons, threw them up on YouTube and found students actually liked it. So that gave me a bit of encouragement to keep going. So then I moved into um, using a tablet, and uh, that was okay, um, but you know, it's quite boring, it's sort of that Khan Academy, uh, writing on a white screen, um, students have to be very motivated to, to sort of pay attention for sort of eight minutes on that sort of text, and especially using an iPad with no stylus, using my finger was quite uh, troublesome. I've actually upgraded um, to a Samsung Galaxy Note, which actually has a stylus, um, and that's a, a little bit more effective than this. But So I thought, you know, yeah, I could record myself, but let's get it down in time. Let's try and get it to about six minutes, the, you know, the golden time. So I tried it on the tablet. Then I moved on to a little bit more production, so uh, a bit of a studio design, which is what I'll be in at, at Brighton School on the PD day. So then you can make uh, some really cool stuff. And that's actually what I'm doing here, I've sort of got a mini, a mini studio set up at the moment and recording. So this is uh, just one of the videos I made which is on haploid versus diploid and you can see that uh, with the setup that we've got at Brighton and at other schools, I've got one at my house, you can actually record your face and record down at the same time using two cameras and then so you can record what's happening uh, on the table and record your face at the same time, which is the best way to engage students. You've already got that relationship with students, um, so uh, they want to see your face. Okay, so um, this is what I've been working on and this is what I'll be helping out on the PD day, helping teachers get to this final stage, which is probably the most difficult. Uh, it's time consuming preparing. It's pretty quick filming. And then there's a little bit of editing involved, some skills around that. So um, really, I hope I can help in that regard. Um, and if, if people have questions, um, we can work through that and 
you know, work through it at later dates as well. So that's really what I'll be planning to doing and that's what I'm doing at the moment. And I basically just got the go ahead from my leadership at Mulberry High School to sort of flip all my classes, change my whole classroom around um, much more in the way where we can work individually with students, which is, is what the best thing about flip learning is. Um, so now I'll just show you a little bit about uh, the actual studio. So I'll pan out so you can see all of this, um, but there'll also be some stuff above and also some of the recording studio um, type software that you can use as well. So hope you enjoyed and I'll see you on the day.